sunscreen and a hat. I got a biopsy on this little red dot. You could barely notice it, um, really, but I got a biopsy on it a few weeks ago and it was confirmed that it was a little skin cancer, um, a basal, basal cell, cell carcinoma. So I'm on a cream treatment for six weeks. It gets my immune system to attack the cancer, which like I, I put it on a radius around like- Thank you so much to this creator for spreading awareness around basal cell carcinoma. BCCs are the most common cancer anyone can get. And thankfully not too aggressive, but if it is neglected and not treated soon enough, it can spread sideways and deeper into the skin. In advanced cases, it can go through the muscle and into the bone. Basal cell carcinomas can be found in young adults. I've seen it in people in their 20s and certain genetic conditions can predispose children to having basal cell carcinomas and that's Gorlin syndrome. Oh, I've seen it quite a bit in Asians, Polynesians when I was living in Hawaii. You can see it in African Americans as well. Another thing that people think is that basal cell carcinomas can hop over to the melanoma track. No, they're separate tumors, separate skin cancers. So a basal cell carcinoma will not turn into a melanoma, but both need to be treated as soon as possible. You can treat BCCs either surgically or use a topical medication with like this creator is using. She's using probably a Miquimod to help stimulate the immune system to go after the tumor selectively. She's using it in a radius around the tumor and it's only selectively picking up the cancer cells, which is quite cool. See your dermatologist for a pimple that's not going away after four weeks, anything that's bleeding on its own or you wash your face and there's an area of fragile skin that bleeds easily. Definitely see your dermatologist. As you can see, I love that she showed a before picture. It was a very subtle red spot on the forehead. Dermatologists have a dermatoscope to look closely and we know what to look for. And I diagnose this every day and I treat this every day. So thank you again for spreading awareness. Take care and peace.